Hello, welcome back to my channel, Erin Ash. I'm Ashley, and I'm just sharing another intuitive message with you today. So today what I wanted to talk about was, well one, we're having Mercury retrograde again um, this week on Friday, I believe. And part of what happens with that is a lot of things from the past can come up that may require another look, another layer to heal. And sometimes it can make us question if we've made um, the right choices in the past or if we have um, if we have a lot of unhealed emotions they will come up to the surface and make it feel like they're really um, really real and not to say that they're not real but they a lot of times the emotions and the feelings and the memories and the past things that are just left unhealed are really just popping up to the surface in order to allow you to look at them again, to change them in some way, to um, reconnect with yourself, reconnect with your inner world, your inner being. There's an internal um, voice that is trying to help us basically become aware of things so that we can heal them. And when we don't allow ourselves enough time to sit still, or allow ourselves to sit in silence. Um, it's almost impossible to know what's really there. And even if you're aware of it, you might be just moving on and moving through your day, but anything that is really left, truly unchecked and unhealed, um, will find its way into, like it will seep its way into your life and eventually your daily life. And at some point we have to decide what's worth it to continue to try to distract and ignore what is actually being said there or to pause and try to actually give it the time and space that it deserves. And when we do that, then we create true growth, true change. And it does, the growth and the change shows up in your internal world in a different way than it does with the validations in the external world. So this is step one. Then you see the outer world reflect that around you, law of attraction included, um, because you've now healed these different layers. I'm seeing it right now a lot in people's relationships, like my different clients' relationships, and it's a beautiful thing because it could also be a past wound of yourself, of, of something that you have gone through, um, or even just a feeling a past feeling that is a trigger for you and you're getting re-triggered this week by it. So it's time to take a moment to sit still and ask yourself, what the hell is really going on there? What is what is What stone has been left unturned? And do we have the strength to really turn it over and maybe, maybe change it? Um, these things can be healed and transmuted in a different way. And it doesn't mean that they won't come up in a new layer in the future, but the only layer you can deal with is the one that's happening right now. So take the moment for yourself and um, show yourself that, that level of care and self-love and you will find success in it. All right, wishing you guys a hopefully very good Mercury retrograde lasts for a couple weeks. Um, I'm sure I'll post more on it, so keep checking back. All right, bye.